wala. Ang atong last one. Okay, so let's start. Please get your pen and paper. So I think makita naman ninyo, no? This is all about identification if the reasoning is deductive or inductive. Let's start with number one. All students go to school. You are a student. Therefore, you go to school. Deductive or inductive? You can get your paper. Did you mabasa? You can have your own paper, any sheet of paper. Anyway, you, you will be the one who will check your answer later. Number two. Since it rained every New Year's Day for the past four years, it will rain on the New Year's Day next year. What kind of reasoning is that? Let's have number three. So actually, the action gap will fluctuate ang kuryente, pero I hope dili maapektuhan ang ato ang session. Number three, deductive or inductive. A child examines ten roses in the garden, all of which are red, and concludes that all roses must be red. Let's have number four. If all isosceles triangles have at least two congruent sides, then an equilateral triangle is also an isosceles triangle. Is it deductive or inductive? Number five. John earned a perfect score on his first six math tests. So he concludes that he will always obtain a perfect score on math test. Number six, if x equals five, then two x equals 10. This is a common statement in Algebra. Is it inductive or deductive? Number seven, if you brush your teeth daily, you will have fewer cavities. Marie brushes her teeth daily. Thus, she will have fewer cavities. That's number seven, deductive or inductive. Number eight, no man has ever gotten pregnant. Thus, Mario will never ever get pregnant. Number nine. Earthquakes usually precede the volcano eruption. So may tabo daw ang volcano eruption after the earthquake. Maguna ang earthquake. After that, na volcano eruption. Thus, earthquakes cause volcano to erupt. That's statement number nine. Is it inductive or deductive? And finally, number ten, Rufus and Rose came back from the beach with sunburns. It must have been a sunny day at the beach. Deductive or inductive? Please prepare your answers and we'll check if you got the correct answer. Let's start with number one. What is your answer for the first one? Deductive. Deductive, sir. Deductive, sir. Deductive, sir. Deductive, sir. Very, it's very obvious. Deductive. So I think everyone got the correct answer. Very obvious because of the word all. We started with all. So all is the first statement, general statement. Then you proceed with specific dion. So that is a deductive, deductive reasoning. Let's see kung buha ba ninyo ang number two. Katong na-observe ni mga si Ulan, it rained in every New Year's Day for the past four years. So based on, based on observation, Manguchka, di ba? 
So kung based on observation, mga single instances, then pa, sa observation ni mo, ka conclusion that is inductive. So I, I think uh, everybody got the correct answer. I don't know ha, nag-assume lang kung uh, kawa ninyo tanan, pero I will ask a letter of this Ah, uh, problema. Number three, inductive siya. Nga nung inductive ng number three? Nag-examine man siya o napulo lang ka rose. So, specific to siya. Tapos, naghimo na siya generalization na all roses must be red. Kaya tungod kay mga red yan nakita nga rose, iyaha rin gi generalize na red tanan ang rose. So, that is an example of inductive. From specific, gi generalize na niya. Tama pa ba mo? Kisa pa dali ang walay mali for the first three statements. Mali ko, sir. Ako, sir. Wala pa mali, sir. Wala pa mali, sir. Wala pa mali, sir. This is a 10 item quiz. So, dapat, you have to get seven. Because seven is a passing score for this. Katong wala pa yung tama. Babae, may permit tama, sir. Dali po. Inductive reasoning na po niya. Kaya imuang babae ang tama. Inductive reasoning to siya. Gihimu lang niya. Kaya tungod ni babae. Tungboy dahil, tungboy. Wala po tayo discrimination dali, ha? Babae or lalaki, equal na tanan. Wala yung gender discrimination. Correct, sir. Number four, if all isosceles triangles, nagsugod siya sa if all isosceles triangles, so it's very obvious nga. Deductive. Deductive. Very good. So na na mo yung hint, di ba? Nagsugod siya sa general, tanan daw isosceles triangle, katong duha ka book equal size, isosceles ang tawag ato. Tapos, nagkuha siya example, equilateral triangle, so specific na. That is also an isosceles triangle, kay more than two naman ang iyahang equal size. Number five. So, kung namalik mo sa first four, so it means unum na lang inyong chances. John earned perfect score on the first six uh, math test. So, based on that, na conclude siya nga, I will always obtain a perfect score. That's inductive. Inductive, day, sir. Inductive. Okay, based on siya observation niya nga. So, first six pa lang ha, six lang gaya ka test, so wala siya perfect siya. So, we are going to generalize and permit it to obtain a perfect score. So, that is inductive. Number six is deductive. Okay, bisag wala kayo nakitaan nga all, naghatag mong good siya og balaod, naghatag siya gruel ba nga, ang value daw sa x kay five. So, x is equal to five is already the general statement. So, that is why, Mahimo siya og 10. Kung himuon mo siyang 2x, mahimo man siyang 2 times x or 2 times 5. That is... Tama ko, sir. Very good. So, kung inaayin mo yung anay mga ba sa exam, kung inaayin mo yung anay sa exam or even sa quiz, kabalo na mo na deductive na siya. If x is equal to, if y is equal to, if a is equal to, kung nalimuan na yun niya o yung anay, then deductive ang tamag. So good for you. Let's have number seven. If you brush your teeth daily, you will have fewer cavities. Marie brushes her teeth daily. You will have fewer cavities. Kaning first statement, bisag wala siya nagamit og all, it is actually a general statement. Kay, di ba common knowledge man na, kabalo man tatanan ani, kung magbrush siya sa toong teeth, di ba gamay naman itong cavities. That is a general statement. That is a common knowledge. Then here comes Marie. Nagkata na kayo example. So specific na niya. So that is deductive. General to specific. Now, number eight. Number eight. No man has ever gotten pregnant. Kaya basta yung mga lalaki diha nga mong claim gani nga buntis na giko. It is a general statement na wala doon yung lalaki nga mabuntis. Here comes Mario. So masulti na ito nga Mario will never ever get pregnant. So from General statement, even though wala tayong nakikitaan nga all the way, pero ang iyahang thought, iyahang idea, nag-present o general statement. Nag-guess ninyo? Then, kanito Mario specific na siya. So, general to specific, it's deductive. I hope you got it correctly. Number nine, kani. Earthquakes usually precede. So, kaning term na usually, kani siya, is delete siya, pero minti mo. Kung anong anong siya usually, Di siya 100% judge, but based on observation ni siya, mauna daw ni siya, then afterwards, na daw volcano nga mo erupt. According to the observer mo ni siya, 
And because of that, nahimo niya ang statement, earthquakes cause volcano to erupt. So this is actually specific ang unang statement to general. So this is inductive. Nagets ninyo? Okay, sir. Tama ko, sir. Okay. Sir. Tama ko, sir. Number 10. Kani, nakita niyo mo mga friends, si Rufus o si Rose. Hala, o nalagay sila mga sunburn. Ikan sila okay. gano'y sunburn. So, yung mga dengi, huna-huna, now it must be a very sunny day sa beach. Kaya nga nung naka-sunburn man sila. So, even though wala ka na-add sa beach, nakita lang niyo ilang mga sunburn, so specific to siya, na instance, nakahimu na ka-generalization na it is a sunny day. So, that is from specific to general inductive. Now, who got... Perfect. 10 out of 10. It means that you are ready for our quiz tomorrow. 8 tra, sir. 8 tra, sir. 8 lang. 9 tra, sir. 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 You got 8. Congratulations. It's okay. It's not recorded. If you lower than 7, you just continue to study. At least, di ba, na ano mo yung experience ka ron? You learn from your mistakes. Very good. That's uh, that's our goal. Every time we meet, our goal is always to to learn something. We should always learn something from our discussion. So congratulations to those who got seven and above. And please prepare for the quiz tomorrow by a quipper. Mo to siyang record nato. So na ay nagpakita og score nila. I can see nagawon og mga cameras. I can see we have nine over ten. Na po mga below seven. It's okay. Again, ha. You just learn from your mistakes. So now let's proceed to our new lesson, and this is all about problem solving in mathematics. So kailangan ako pangitaon ang presentation kay Ganina na apil mo siya kaputol sa pag fluctuate sa kuryente. So I will now present to you the material for the problem solving. I hope you can see it now. Na share na nako. Na the art of problem solving. We are all solving problems in our daily life. Kasi wala naman siguro yung tao nung wala yung problem. All of us yes. are facing problems. Depende lang siguro sa atong capacity or sa ato ang kahanas na mo. O mudala sa problem. Ang uban kay dili obvious. Ang uban kay makitaan dyan nga yung mga problem. But generally, problem solving is part of our life. And it is defined as a process by, by which an individual uses his or her previously acquired knowledge and skills and understanding to satisfy the demands of an unfamiliar situation. So, ang pasabot, Annie, usually kung natin mga problems, especially kung unfamiliar sa ato, ah, ato ang i-recall ang ato ang previous experiences. Tama ba? Kung ito ang huna-huna, ang giyong sa ito na ako pag-solve atong problem na ako. Kaya pwede ito ni mo siya himuon nga. Experience. Kaya pwede ni mo usabon, di ba nga? Ala, kato na akong problema ato, ginanin ni na ako pag-solve. Inanti on, kung na ako pag-solve ka ron. Things like that. That is also true sa math, di ba? Because in problem solving, we are developing creative and critical thinking. So na ito yung mga problem sa math na na-encounter. Na-encounter rin ako sa elementary ko. Na-encounter rin ako sa high school ko. Gusto sa ito na ako pag-solve. So i-recall ni mo and then you try to apply kung applicable pa ba siya. Then that will help you answer your problem. And when we say problem solving, we will be discussing the different ways to solve problems. So daghag mga strategies in problem solving. Just like sa life na ito, di ba? In solving our problems, Pwede ta mga yung tabang sa parents, pwede ta mag, siguro kung kaya na to, we can do it alone, or pwede po, we can ask the help of our Almighty Father. There are different ways to solve the problems, di ba? So sa math po, naatay different strategies. So we cannot always say nga, ay, mali mo ang solution, kay wala ka nang follow sa gisulti na ako. Kay lailahing tao, lailahing mag-strategies ang ato ang kaya himuon, di ba? Do you agree with that? Yes, sir. So sa math, usahay, kung mag-solve ta, makita na ito, lalahi lagi ang solution sa imong classmate, pero pareha lagi mag-answer. Does it mean mali iya hang solution kay di mo parehas? Dili. 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 Okay. In mathematics, there are a lot of strategies. 
Other words, if I it, there are many ways to kill a cat. Different ways. So whatever your manner is, as long as nakuha to ni mo ay mong goal, then that can be accepted. So bawal ka masulting. Ay, mali mong answer, kay mali mong solution, kay wala ka nag-follow sa koa. So siguro ma, dungan na ito sa una sa mga teachers masulti, pero generally that is not a correct idea. Because you may have your own strategy in, pro in solving a problem. The teacher can just give a hint or a formula. Pero at the end of the day, ikaw mangod ang magdaga process ay mong mind. Masig na kay imuhang own way, unique way, and mas simple, simple nga way to get your answer. That is okay. So sa problem solving na to, again, I encourage Jod nga, kamo mismo ang solve sa problem. Pero na mga strategies nga gipang suggest, just like kaning gipang sulat tiri sa inyong screen. Mabasa ba ninyo? Yes, sir. Familiar ba mo, Ani? Yeah, probably. Ah, hindi ang from familiar sa inyo ang strategy. Guessing and checking. Guessing and checking. Kadawa, sir. Kadawa. Using a table or chart. Very good. Kung sa pa? Trial and error. Drawing a sketch. Drawing a sketch. Also. Drawing a sketch. Yes. Yes, sir. Sketch nila. Using common sense, sir. And the pinaka uncommon there is using, using common sense. sense. Kaya common sense magurusay kay sa yun ang problem pero gina complicate ninyo nga layo na kayo ang solution na abta na mo pila ka oras ug sinol tapos sa gig argue na mo tapos so simple de kayo ang answer di ay. Kani <laughs> trial and error common po ni siya para sa ni guessing and checking. Kana ganing halam mali man akong answer pero ayon gapon ka try na po kag another, another strategy until makuha ni mo ang final answer. Trial and error is also a common strategy. So, di pisagun saan ni pwede nyo gamiton. Katong general problem solving method, mo na to akong atong gamiton to guide us with our activity nga mag-solve of problem. Kanin siya actually, gihata ni siya elementary pa lang ta. Katong ganing, what is us in the problem? What operation will be used to solve the problem? Katong ganing mga questions ana sa libro. It's actually the four-step method of Polya. Si Polya ang author ato. Even though wala na si Polya karon pero yahang work gina recognize gihapon in solving the problem. According to him, ang first method daw ng himuon before ka mag-solve sa problem is dapat kasabot ka sa problem, understand the problem. Kaya kung nasabta ni mo ang problem, pwede na ka maghimu plano. Step two, devise a plan. So sa plano ni mo, kanto imong strategy, magdrawing ba kag sketch? Maghimu ba kag table? Mag-trial and error ba ka? Then if you are okay with the plan, ang next ni mong himu on is dapat imuhang i-implement, i-carry out imong plan. And sa pag-carry out imong simong plan, dito ni mo kita imuhang answer. Step number four, kung na nakay answer ka ron, imuhang i-check kung tama ba ito yung answer. You have to look back. Maliko ni mo ang problem, tanaw ni mo kung nag so, natubag ba jud sa pangutan na imong answer. So that's the four step method of polya. Sabta ninyo? Yes, Ato aning gamiton karon. Let's have the first problem. Kaning using a table or chart is just a suggested method ha, pero naa sa inyo kung gamitan ba ninyo table or chart. I will not present the correct answer. I will let you type your answer sa chat box. Then after that, Ako ano i-present ang answer then I will check kung kinsa ang kakwag tamang answer. The first one who will get the correct answer will have additional points for the recitation, participation. Kindly read the first problem. May I request RJ Kahetas. A man put a, a, man put a pair of rabbit, rabbits in the cage. During the first month, the rabbit proceeds I produce a number of but but each month thereafter produce one new pair of rabbits. Each of newly produced pair reproduce in the same manner. How many pair of rabbits will there be at a, at at the end of five months? Very good. So thank you so much for reading the problem. I hope you got the first step of polia. Understand the problem. Let's have done in your situation. Nasabdan ba ninyo ang gihata ng problem? You can type your answer, ha? Kay, uh, basi ang uban kay mo. Kung si answer ni Koan, sundugun po. Pero lang kayo ko sa... 
okay na to mga karon pa nag-abot sa ato ang meeting kay karon naman puta nagsugod. Okay, we had a review a while ago about deductive and inductive. And you can actually review the video later kung ma-upload na siya. Dahil nagsugod og answer og 10, nagsunod po tanan og 10. I don't know if this is the correct answer. So, siguro kung mali ni siya, mali. Ako sir, kablo ko sir. I-type ninyo ang answer, uh, Venus. Kaya kung di ka ka-type, sige, isulti na lang. Ako na lang i-record diri, Venus. O si answer ni Venus. Type na lang ako sir. <laughs> ah, sige, type na lang ni mo. Uh, we have a unique answer, zero. Pantihon, you are raising your hand. I'm reading actually the answers there is a group chat. Yes, Pantihon. Zero, sir. Zero? Walay rabbit nga ma-produce at the end of fifth month? Sa cage? So meaning nangamatay, Tanan? Sir, man. Proilan, what is your problem? Do you have... Naka-answer naman ka, Froylan. You are raising your hand. There, produce in the same manner. How many pairs of rabbits will there be at, this, at the end of the, of the month? fifth month? Froylan, yes? Um, 20, sir. Ay. 20. Dagahan ka kag-answer, gihatag mo. Nagsugod ka 10, tapos sa mong fifth. 20, 20 ang tama. 20, 20, okay, okay. 20, 20 ang final. Sure. Final sa 20. Sige, I will take that answer. While the others are also giving their answers, we have 8, 6, 5, 12, 10, 8. Okay, so until there lang, 6.09 ang time. Dapat wala na mo hatag answer ha. After 6.09, okay, I will now present the correct answer. If this is the problem, kung sabtun mag mo ang problem, kanin mag-ud ang ibutang dari. How many rabbits... Pairs have by pair and counting. How many pairs of rabbits will there be at the end of five months? If the case is this, isa ka pair ang gibutang sa first month. Pero, ang iyahang manner of production, mga good, is dili siya makaproduce o offspring, wala siya'y anak, sa first month niya dito sa cage. Uh, Sabta ninyo ang problem? Balik ka to sa problem. Plus, sir. During the first month, the rabbits produce no offspring ah, during the eight. first month. So the first month is a cage, wala pa siya produce. Thereafter, so the following month, makaproduce na siya. Pero ang produce niya is one pair lang of rabbits. So that will be the manner of reproduction nila. Kato siya nga problem. So katong bago na po nga na, na produce nga rabbit, musunod nga po siya sa role, di siya pwede mag-produce kung first month pa niya sa cage. Kaya katong mga karaan na, hala, sige, padayon sila produce one lang po per month. If that is the case, devise the plan, we will construct the table that is suggested strategy, then this will be the plan. We carry out ato ang plan. 609 ang cut off, no? So the first one to get eight, I will now review the group chat. Kinsa ang pinakauna naghatag answer nga 8, nga wala pa ko nag-present sa answer. Actually, ang pinakauna naghatag nga answer is 10. Then, daghag ng sunod, 0, 10, 5, 8, 6, uh, 0, 15, 16, 15, 10. Marvin Dave the Abay. Marvin Dave the Abay, please uh, respond if you are here because you will claim additional points for your recitation. Okay. We're getting the correct answer. Congratulations the Abay. Are you here? Kung wala yung response no kay ano mahatag ni siya sa next nga nag-answer. Busy na sir, atarbaho. The Abay is here. Mr. The Abay, I would like to know, do we have the same solution? Nag-ibo ka table? Ako, para sa ako sir, kay delete na pa rin. Ayun but lang sir. Ako ang solution mo good sir. Pag tanong, pag sabot na sa kanang problem sir kay, pwede pakibalik sa ano sir, sa taas sir. Sige, ang problem. Yes, sir. Uh, sir, 64. <laughs> 64, uh, you learn from your mistakes. Kani? During first month. your time right now to explain. Ana si sir, during first month, the rabbits produce no offspring. So first month, kay naka first month sir, wala wala pa siya sir. Wala pa siya mm -hmm. kanang produce nga pair. So, so therefore, pagkasunod nga pagkasunod na 
na month, one new pair of rabbits. Kaduhan na sila. Kaduhan na na, sir. Do, isa na, sir. If, mm -hmm. if each newly produced pair produce, ay, produce pair reproduce in the same manner, how many rabbits will be will there be at the end of pairs? the fifth month? How many pairs so, of rabbits? So, gikwinta na ko, sir. Fifth month, sir. Katong fifth month, kwa na yun tog ka ng ano, sir? Kwa na tog isa ka month kay ana siya sa offspring, wala pa daw. So, ang four wala month pa. times two by pair man, sir. So, eight, sir. Mo na answer, sir. Ah, okay. Ang iyahang concept, mga good isa, concept of pair because one pair involves two two persons or in this case two animals nga rabbit so di ba siya matawag nga pair kung duha so luckily ang iyang definition sa pair nga two gimultiply niya sa four nakuha niya ang eight pero makuha to nato siya or matawag to nato siya as actually very lucky kinatam nakuha po niya ang tamang answer pero kung tanaw nato kung idiretso nato four times two Pwede na pwede ta mamali ana no kay kung paabot ta og ka nang how about kung 6 months so 5 times 2 ta so we can actually check the table kung 6 months ba ma-apply ba tong atong formula nga i-multiply nato times 2 murag dili na di ba so mahulog nga na chambahan or very lucky si Mr. Da Abay to get the correct answer so anyway kung baliko nato ang table Ibalik na to present ang table. In ato yun ang dagway niya. Sa so first month, pwede siya ma-produce kay Shara man isa. So magsugod siya isa sa second month. Sa second month, pwede siya makaproduce ng isa. So duha na sila kabuok. So sa third month, duha sila kabuok magsugod. Ang isa lang makaproduce ato, kaya ang isa baguhan pa man, first month pa man sa cage. So tulo lang kabuok. So at the end of this, pagsugod sa fourth month, magsugod sila, tulo sila kabuok. Pero... Ang, kung ano ito, ang isa nga na-produce, dili siya pwede ka-produce, ang katulang duha. So lima sila kabuok na-produce at the end of fourth month. So pagka uh, abot ang fifth month, nagsugod sila lima. So katong tulo lang ang makaproduce kaya ang duha ato bago pa. So five plus three plus eight. That is actually the logic about why the answer is eight. So nasabta ninyo? Yes, sir. Pakataba ang table. Pakataba ang table. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But uh, luckily, Mr. Abay got the correct answer. Let's have another one. So eight is the number of pairs. And you can actually check, look back. Actually, look back na ito ganina. Pagbalik na ito dali sa table. Then eight yun sila kabuo. Let's have another problem. So uh, pwede mo maghimog table or you can have your own solution. Again, the first one to get the correct answer. So I will now... Next I will now start ha, the second problem. So for the second problem, you can read on your own. To her brother, while her father gave, gave of Mike Bade. Okay, pag abut anig time, uh, adin na ako accept ang mga ano kulang. So for the second problem, you can start sending your answers now. Sige, murag ang uban kay gusto nila na imo basa no, sige. I will call a reader kasi kasi tig basa diri, kasi reader diri. Ko sir, ko sir. To the grace of hand. Ko sir, ko sir. You discaliar base, you discaliar ka murag reader ni sa simbahan. Sige, go ahead Mr. Discaliar. Read. Mila, ha, Mila has five marbles on Monday. On the next day, she gives up one marble to her brother while her father gives her two new marbles. It, if she gives the same number of marbles to her brother and receives the same number of marbles from her father every day, how many marbles will have on Friday? Thank you so much. So I hope na inyo ha to nasabtan no ang problem. Kung wala nyo nasabtan, you can read it on your own. Nama ko yung mga marbles din nga gina, ano, gina, tatawag ano eh, na-involve gani sa problem. na gihatag na gibawi na gihatag na gibawi things like that. So, pila daw ang iyahang marbles at the end of, from Monday to Friday. So, pila to ka adlaw. Let's see. Chat box, I can see answers like 7, 10, 20. 
the first one to get the correct answer before I reveal the answer will get the correct uh, the additional points. Vidal, na na nag na nag eleven, na nag ten. Okay, wala na. Nag-enta sa 98, 940, 90, ano, 20. Nay, nag-answer o sir. Number ang answer ani. Ha? How many marbles will have on a Friday? So, number ang answer ani. Six eighteen is the time. So, 618, cut off. Pag 619, wala na. And anyway, I think for na nakakuwag answer na tama. Naabay na kakwag 9. I will review. Time is up na. Let's see because the correct answer for this is 9. I have 32 na 8. Uh, 8 kasagaran. Ta, well, sir. Sir, sir, ah. ano ding? Ibalik na sa ano, sir. Kaya pa sa, tanaw na ako. Kung naabay na ako yung interview ko na rin nga makakwag tamang answer. 14, 11, 11, 10. 8, 13, 11, 15, 8, 14, 8, 20, 20, 20. Nobody got the correct answer. Okay, let's... Bagsak mo yan. Let's explain. Anong 9 siya, ha? Mila has 5 marbles to start with on Monday. On the next day, she gives 1 marble. So, pagka Tuesday, dito pa nakuhaan niyang marble. Okay, sa may next day sa Monday, Tuesday, di ba? Makuhaan siya isa ka marble, ihatay siya yung brother. At the same time, naa siya yung madungag na duha ka marbles, kay maghatay yung papa o duha ka marble. If that is the pattern every day, na maghatay siya permintig isa sa yung brother, then makadawat po siya o duha sa yung father, pila na daw yung marbles on Friday. So kung imong mong huna on di ba naa siya makuha duha sa yung father, tapos naa siya ihatay sa yung brother isa, so na ay isa ka marble, in other words, nga iyahang mag-gain kada adlaw. So kung na siya yung isa ka marble mag kada adlaw, so ang 5 sa Monday, mahimong 6 sa Tuesday, 7 sa Wednesday, 8 sa Thursday, 9 sa Friday. Tama ba? Or kung himuon ni mo kaninga table, 5 minus 1, kaya nakata siya sa yung brother, equals 4. 4 plus 2, kaya nakata mo niyang father, so 6. So, ang 6 na po, makuwag is brother, 5. Madungagag 2, kaya nasa father yung ihatag, so 7. And 7 na po, makuwag isa, then madungagag duha. And then, ang 8, makuwag isa, madungagag duha, 9. Nakuha ninyo? I get it, sir. Oo, oh, sir. Kulang oh, ang mga... Unfortunately, wala yung nakuha. Kulang ang mga solution. Kulang isa. Okay lang, it's okay, because we are learning. So that is one of the kinds of problems that we may encounter in math. Still have another one. Kani. I will give you a chance also to give your answer. But uh, para sabay tanan ng answer, I will call another reader. Another reader kanang mabasa o klaro ni Kaila. Go ahead, Kaila. Okay. Start with an unknown number. Triple it, then subtract 5. Now, take the new number and double it, but then subtract 47. If you take this latest total and quadruple quadruple it, you have 60. What was the original unknown number? Thank you, Kaila, for reading our problem. So, ni abot siya og 60. Dagang kakipanghimo, di ba? You start with something na wala kakabalo. Git triple to ni mo siya, times 3. Tapos, gimainusan ni mag 5. And then, gidouble na po ni mo siya times 2. Then, nag-subtract na po kag 47. Afterwards, imuha na po siyang gi-quadruple, gi-times 4 na po ni mo siya, nahimo siyang 60. The question is, kung sa itong number imong gisugtan, what was the original unknown number? So, ang suggested niya, isa rin nga strategy, you can use working backwards daw. Or I don't know with you, you can have trial and error. You can have guess and checking. 
So you may start uh, typing your answer for number three now. I will wait for around one minute. No. Okay. Okay, after 6.24, bawal na mag-send o answers. So, 6.24... So, na nag-answer, 15, we have 7, we have 8, we have 17, we have 10. I think, murag na ay nakahatag. O sa ito sa nag-start gani nga time, isa pinakauna nagkatawag answer. Ako, oh, sir. Si Pasaol ang nagkatawag answer. What is the first answer? Nagkatawag 10? 15. Ay, 15. So, sa 6.23 ta magsugod, no? So, si Froilan ang una nagkatawag. We have 15 followed by 7, 20, and then 5, 6, 8, 9, 8, 9, 10, 12, 10, 11, 5, and so on. Okay, so time is up for this problem. I will now reveal the solution. Kani mag-guti, hindi mo makuha kung wala kay daghang time na mag-guess. Pero if you will do the backwards, kaning backwards mag-guti mo, i-reverse, mag-suhul ka sa pinakatumoy. So you have to start with the last statement. That is how you do the working backwards. So that is the most effective strategy that we can use to answer this problem. So dagagiagian ang number, di ba? It has a lot of changes, mga operations, before it turned out 60. So nasabta na ito ang problem. The plan is working backwards. So how do we carry out working backwards? So we will start with the last number, which is 60 of the last sentence. Di ba ang pinakaduol sa 60 is ulti di quadruple? When we say quadruple, it means times 4. What is the reverse of times 4? Kung saan niya ang para mabaliktad siya, di ba ang times 4 ang iyahang reverse operation sa multiplication and division? That's why it's correct, division. Divide by 4. So ang 60 divide by 4 to undo quadruple. So the answer is 15. So, 15 ang value kung katong number, i-quadruple ni mo siya, 15 times 4, 60, which is correct. Pero, wala pa tayo na Kaya na pa man siya, subtract 47. What is the reverse of subtraction? What is addition? Plus, sir, plus. Mag-plus ka or mag-add ka 47. So, katong 15 ganina, i-add ni mo siya 47. So, you will have 62. And then, apo siya yung mention na double. So, ang double it times 2. What is the reverse of double? Divide, sir. Divide by 2. Very good. So, katong 62 ganina, na result sa pag-add mo 47 sa 15, divide mo 2. So, 62 divided by 2, 31. 
Pero na apa mampu nih tabu dari, na apa yang subtract five? So what is the reverse of subtracting by five? Add, add, mag add pakai five atau thirty one, so you have thirty six. And then, na apa macam word ngah triple? You have the triple dah sya, triple means times three. What is the reverse of triple? Divide by three. So thirty six divided by three is twelve. The correct answer is twelve. Therefore. The point will be awarded to Mr. Labajo. Where is Labajo? Can we highlight Mr. Labajo and uh, ask him, how did you get to answer Labajo? Patay. Patay. <laughs> Pwede ka na lang kay score, Ani. Imuha na lang i-explain. Paras ganina kay Daabay ba to? Gusto na ka-answer ganina? Kay Daabay to, no? Yeah, even though yung yahang answer is not really connected to the problem, pero naswertihan manggut siya kung naka kung kung ano siya raffle draw pani siya na naswertihan siya nakadaub siya how about you naswertihan lang ba din ni mo or do you have your own unique solution na pwede ni mo share ang ating sobrin sir malik manggut just na timingan lang yun na siya sir at twelve so dagan yung kaswertihon dering ng klasi mo sa exam niyo kaya lang iba kung swerte swerte rani na adlo ang six ni sir gidip par na ko sir Ah, okay. Katong 60, gidivide ayun mo. Tapos 12, yung answer. Oh. Yes, sir. Pero, ano, thank you so much, Labaho. Anyway, because of that, siguro swerte kayo kasi mong horoscope ka ron. Naga po kay score. Si Albansis. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Si Albansis, saka ko pa siya tama ang answer o 12 po. Kasi si Albansis na ay tama ang solution. Yung sa si Albansis. Any response from Albansis? Hello, Albansis. Wala, sir. Iyo sa'yo mo, Albansis? Try and error ko, errors ko, sir. Try and error. Try and error ka, okay. So, iyo sa'yo mo pagkabalo nga. Ha, mungan yun siya ang tamang answer. Iyo mo habang gi, ano, ibalik. So, we will perform the, ano ha, we will perform the checking. Katukan yung step number four sa polya, look back and check. So, balik ka sa problem before we end our session. So, kung magsugod sa 12, baliko na ito, i-follow na ito niya hanggang isulti 3. I-triple na ito ang 12. So, everybody please get your calculator. 12 times 3. Triple minus. 36. Very good. Then, subtract 5. 36 minus 5. 31. Very good. Now, take the new number, 31. Double it. 31 times 2. 32. 32. 62. And then subtract 47. 62 minus 47. 62 minus 47. 15. Very good. 15, the latest total. And quadruple it. So 15 times 4. You will have 60. Therefore, 12 is the correct answer. Diba? May balanin mga 12 ang tamang answer. Kay 60, my good. Anong gawas? Diba? 3 pa na. 9 na siya. Oh, kung lahi nga number yung mong gigamit, lahi yun ang pawas, dali 60. But anyway, we have just started. We still have a lot of problems to solve. So for now, we're going to end our session. I will stop recording. Okay, up sa mic, buddy. Saan na yung question? 